All right, guys, we are live. Does it actually feel like Friday for anyone? <laughs> One second, guys. Stephanie Barger just commented she wanted uh, to get in. So much weight. Um, oh my God, you can hear me? Oh, my mom. <laughs> I'll mute you, don't worry. Don't mute me. No, everyone's getting me. Are you here? No, shh, wait. Hold on, guys. Uh, Maybe you can't. I got. I... <laughs> hey, go ahead. Yeah. Don't say this too loud, but how happy are you to be online? Yeah. <laughs> She's <laughs> muted. Okay. All right, guys. Um, grab your whatever weights you have as we kind of get going. Again, you'll make do with what you have going on. Um, if you have a heavy and a lighter one, you might want to have both of those handy. And um, we're going to get started in a second. I think this is going up today. Yeah, I was just trying to do it. Are you doing it? Yeah. Oh, you got it. Yeah. All right, we got some tunes today. Um, I will speak loud. All right, guys, we're going to start with a warm up. So on your mats, come on down to the ground. Plank position to start. It might be a little bit different than we were doing. Press back to down dog and then forward to plank. Back to dog, forward to plank. Good. Five more of these. Back, forward, push the floor away. Back, four. Three, two, one. Good. Hold plank position. Bring your hands close together, your feet a little wider, shoulder tap. Alternate. Tap your shoulder and switch. Keep your hips steady by squeezing the muscles of the leg through the glutes. Ten. Eight. Six, good. Let's get the core working up. Last four. Two. And one. Good. Widen your hands. We're lowering all the way down for those hand release push ups. Lower down all the way to the belly. Release the hands. Plant all the way up. Lower down with control. Release the hands. Plant and push. Five more. Last two. Yes, stand all the way up. Take your right foot forward, left foot back. We're going to do split squats. So in place, you're going to lower your knee down and up. You can go hands on your hips by your side. Lower down. Friday. Last five. Four. Shouldn't do too many. We do have a lot of legs today. Alex has been talking about his excitement for it. Switch all these. Right leg back. Tap the knee. Push through the front foot. You want to have a flat front foot. Julie and I did not plan our outfits, but we are close. I still feel very left out, so. You didn't bring your bright orange bottoms. Four more. Three, two, one. Good. Knee hugs. Pull up, switch. Keep your back straight. As you pull your leg up to you. Three, we're gonna go in two. Figure four is in place. 
So you're gonna cross, sit back, stand and switch. Hips loosened up a little bit so we can actually do these squats. I don't know if you can buy those anywhere right now. <laughs> All out of legs. <laughs> Three more. Two. One. All right. Just gonna, if you can jump where you're at, you can lift off the ground. Scott, you're just kind of bouncing. You got 30 seconds here. Keep the arms up by the sides. I don't know if you guys have ever done a TikTok video, but. Flair is trying to do. I'm recruiting them, and I feel like it's a good mission to have like conquer one stance video a week all right squat position let's warm up the squat toes turn out a little bit 10 body weight squats reach arms forward sink down pull it up dog we got pretzels coming through i think Last two. All right, guys. So we have the goblet squat and the single leg squat first. Um, just as a reminder, goblet squat, weight at your chest, squatting down, elbows to knees, and up. For the single leg squat, if you have a couch nearby or a stool, you can use that. Um, if you don't have anything, you can just do it with no, uh, no support, and I'll show you how it looks. So if you have nothing from the side, you can either keep your toe in front of you, sit back, and stand. Sit, stand. A little more advanced would be with the leg lifted. Sit, sit, and stand. And then if you have something, an ottoman, whatever it might be, you can now keep the leg forward, stand, lower down. So this is in place of the tiara. All right, we're gonna do three rounds today. Um, if you feel like you want more after, you can do a whole nother round of everything once we sign off. So <laughs> it's and your if you do, send us a video. Yeah, it's your Friday, guys. Um, all right, so we're gonna do it together. Grab your weight. We have 12 reps of everything. All right, weight up at the chest. It's an inhale, down, exhale up. Ready, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, press the knees out, eight, Nine, exhale up. Ten, last two. Weight down. Single leg squat. You can go a little bit slower. All right, either leg up or down. Twelve, count it to yourself. Again, totally fine to, to, to use your other foot as a kickstand. What I'm doing is keeping most of the weight in my right leg as I use the left. Maybe now I want to try making it a little harder. Trying to not slam down on the bench. Last two for me. Controlling the knee with the hip. 12 on the other side once you finish. At least we'll be building nice glutes, and when we get to come out of hiding, um, 
you guys are all gonna look really good. Just don't drink too much. Again, these are slower. I'm gonna try and not even use that bench. Right, I can use my other foot forward to help me reaching the arms, pushing through that bottom foot to stand. All right, grab water. We're gonna take about 30 to 45 seconds rest. How's everyone doing? Give me a thumbs up. Pretzels in view. I've lost. Chelsea's out of, good, all right. We have a double screen going on because when we record, we can't see you guys. So we got two screens here. All right, guys, round two now. I'm gonna go a little heavier. Ready? Yep. Weights up. Here we go. Down, up. Push the floor away to get up. Keep your abs engaged. Don't let the back arch. Alex is going so fast to be hearing you be a baby weight. I'm gonna jump on his back next round. I prefer back squats over front squats. Go. Feel free to take a second. When you're ready, single leg. Find the most challenging variation for you. This is where you can start to <clears throat> balance any imbalances. If you're using no weight, you don't have to sit on to something. Let the knee go slightly forward so you can get down while the heel stays down. The arms reaching forward is super helpful. Sit as low as you can. Full pistol squat gets your butt to the ground and back up without pulling anything. So you can start to use a super low surface over time. You develop strength in that full range. Well, now you challenge me. I feel like I need to have your belt for the last time. I think you should. <laughs> All right, we're on rest here. He did squat 300 yesterday, so. Oh, my give, baby. give him a little credit, just a little bit. <laughs> All right, get into our last set. We can move into some upper body. All right, bring those bells up. Here we go. Sit, push down and get up. Control your descent. Feel your butt sit a little bit below the knees. That's three, two, and one. Single leg, maybe you want to start on your uh, non dominant side. All right. I 
I'm gonna work it without the bench just because I feel myself getting lazy there. So super important to stabilize the knee. You can see yourself to be able to see what's going on. Your body will shift a little bit to uh, make up for being on one leg. Ooh. All right, other side when you're ready. Next week, we're going to uh, be tan, you guys. <laughs> we realized how unfortunate the Zoom lens is. So, we're going to do a little at home sunless tanner. We got two more. No. no. All right. Great work. Get a little water. You'll need one bell. Keep it a little bit off to the side. The bell that you're using is going to be for a one arm bent over row. I'll demo from the beginning. So, we obviously can't really do lat pull downs at home, but you can get your lats engaged with the Superman lat pull. So, you're going to reach your arms forward like you're holding a pull bar, and as you exhale, pull the elbows down and squeeze. Inhale, reach. Exhale, squeeze. Contract the glutes and feel your abs crunch. Reach, pull. All right. Next one is going to be the bent over row. Okay, so you can take a staggered lunge position here, and I'm going to pull up to my hip. Don't pull so high, your elbow's jacked up, okay? It's not a high pull, I'm going to pull back. And then our last one is a plank alternating reach. So, plank position, I'm going to reach forward. Watch the shifting of the hips. All right? So, we're going to start with the Superman lap pull. We have 15 of these. So, come on down to the ground. Really imagine you're on a pull up bar here. You just move the arms. You're not going to get much out of this one, okay? Reach the arms forward. Here we go, exhale, pull. One, two, exhale, three, four. Good, contract the glutes as you pull. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, five. Four, squeeze down, three, two, really dial in, mind to muscle, one. Press up, grab your weight. This might be a little overzealous, but go on with it. All right, staggered stance. Wrestle. All right, here we go, 12, pull, one. Don't pull too high. Two, three, unshirt the shoulder. Five, six. You should feel your lats here, your back. Bicep comes second. Four more. Four, three, squeeze in. Two, one, change sides. Oh, I'm sweating a lot today. Here we go. Pull. One. Pull back. Two. Three. Four. Five. Weight to the hip. Six. Seven. Last four. Last two. 
foot. Ooh. All right, guys, plank position. The wider your feet, the easier it is. Okay, keep your hips level. Here we go, we'll go right first. Reach. Three. Five. Keep crunching your butt. Seven. Belly in. Ten more. Ten. Imagine you're pushing your back down, belly up. Let your abs shake. Four. Three. Two. One. Ugh. Woo. Wow. Rest. I don't know what Friday's felt like in class, but <laughs> this feels kind of hard, so. Take about 10 more seconds here. Right, that lap pull, really feel the squeeze, and you're gonna take your butt down, abs in the whole time. All right, down to the ground. Arms reach forward. Take a breath in. And exhale, pull, reach, pull, two, three, four, five, crunch your abs, six, eight, Please pull your whole self up to that bar. Good job, guys. Stay with it. You've got three more. Three, two, and one. Only because we're live here am I going to not cheat and switch weights, okay? So, <laughs> if you're struggling, stick with it. All right, staggered stance, bend over row. And make sure you see Alex there, too. You're not pulling up too high. Here we go. One. Six one. Good job. Three. Two. One. Other side. Get that back nice and strong. Here we go. 12 breaths. Pull. Keep pushing, guys. Three. I don't know what we were thinking when we made this one. <laughs> Plank alternating reach down to the ground. I really want you guys to feel when you're in plank position that you're keeping the contraction here. So don't lose it over time as you reach and you arch your back like this. You should be drawn in as you do that, even if the arm doesn't come all the way up by the ear. Never lose this. Here we go. High plank lift, and we get it. Don't worry about the arm, it's gonna lift. Focus on the middle of, our, of your body. <laughs> Four more. Oh, rest. Woo, grab water. Apparently, we 
have to do that again. Oh, fuck. <laughs> we used to four times. I guess that. You buy it for Fiji, it's still going out to be called. Uh, it can't swim in the No, on, on uh, Evite. Evite. I got it, yeah. George said something about it. Blair is starting a pretty cool party. Actually. Blair, I mean, George said something about it. He was like, is this real? I was like, I thought he was talking about the yes, virtual, virtual party. Exclusively. Oh, yeah. Not reading what he said. Yeah. He goes, you're going to have a hard time getting a reservation somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. We're not going. Unfortunately, although Benefit did send me a confirmation, so I mean, I'm still canceling that. All right, we got our third set, but maybe we will do a virtual party. I'll see who's got the best. I want to figure out how to play Cards Against Humanity on the video call. Okay. Everybody has a deck if you get the spot figure out. Yeah, and then everyone just has to hold up their spot. Okay. You can do this. Oh, no, well, no, because know. then, because then they know who it is. Uh, okay. We'll figure it out. We're just distracting you guys. All right, here we go. Last set. Lift and pull. One, two. Even fitness professionals don't always want to work out, but we really do. We're just glad we have some people keeping us accountable too. Five to go. Three. One, plant, press. Line up, pop up, like a burpee. All right, bent over rows for the last time. The last set is actually gonna be really nice. Not the one we're doing, but. Well, kind of. I don't think that's what I like. <laughs> <laughs> The second, uh, yeah, single like that looks good. All right, 12 rows each side. Here we go. Go ahead and pull. Nice, easy tempo. Down and up. Dial in to the side you're pulling on, where you want to put your mind at. <sighs> don't drop those weights. And switch when you're done. We close to the hip. Don't round your spine. Keep your gaze right in front of you. Always working posture. <clears throat> All right, once you finish, meet me in a high plank. Just starting in five, four, three, lift, two, and go. Reach, reach, good. Push away with your bottom hand. Plug in with the belly. See how much you can feel like you're not sinking into the ground, but pushing your hand down, strengthening your legs, drawing your abs in. Last five, four, three, two, one. Uh, oh, okay. Shoulders. Take a second. Alex is gonna demo cool. <laughs> the single leg deadlift and the side plank with leg lifts. Want one bell, not two. So he's gonna go. He's on his left hand, so his right foot's gonna be down. Back leg's lifting. And he's keeping that bell close to the body as he kicks me. So notice the bell doesn't travel forward. It's right over his toe. 
where a lot of mistakes are made. His back is straight and he hinges deep at his hip. You don't push your butt back, you're not doing a single leg deadlift. All right, side plank. You're either going to hold or you're going to leg lift. Notice though that he's still grounding through that bottom foot and that as he lifts his top leg, his bottom hip doesn't drop to the ground. So he's got a nice straight line on that underside, okay? So that's what you're working there. All right, so grab your belt and stand up. We're gonna go bell in the left hand, right foot down. And this is a slow lower here. All right, here we go. Right below the knee. Four. Push your big toe down. Six. Stretch back. Soft bend in your front knee. Last three. I know you guys are used to lower reps, but to uh, size. Since most likely a lighter weight, we, uh, we increase the reps. All right, switch. Nice stable body here. And go. Control. Push the stance. Only thing that's happening is a hinge at the hip. Stretch your foot back. Ground through your front big toe. Last three. <sighs> side plank, guys. We're going left side first. <sighs> Ten. Alex wanted to do some insane amount, like fifteen, <laughs> but now I don't. I don't think he's done these in a while. Yeah. Or he's Superman. All right, lift it up. Here we go. Five. Last two. Uh, switch. Yeah. <laughs> If you're holding, just hold till I say stop. Shoulder stacked over the elbow, straighten the legs, stack the feet, and go. Push down through the side of the foot. Keep your legs straight. One, okay, rest. You've got a minute, rest. <laughs> All right, we got about 30 seconds. How's everybody looking? Still with us, Natalie? Good. All right, guys. Let's stand it up. Is Dre working out, Ashley? Got to get his butt in here. All right, in your frame, not in, not in our <laughs> gym. Okay, single leg deadlift. Left hand with the bell. Stand all the way up. Here we go, 12. Take your time on these. Keep your focus. And I'll go a little bit different pace. Keep 
can reach your arm out to the side for counterbalance. to reach your other arm out to the side. Otherwise, I keep falling. So see what works for you. If you do that, stiffen that arm up. Really, that one muscle that's not working here. That's the great thing about at-home workouts is you're not really isolating much because you have to stay more functional. Forces the body change a little bit. And 12. When you're done, coming down for side plank. If you felt like you just couldn't lift your leg up, hold a really strong side plank. All right, first side, three, two, lift, and go. Don't just think about your top leg, really contract that bottom leg. That glute should be on fire. Four, three, two, one. Change side. <laughs> All right, ready and lift. Sweat for you. Two. Stay strong here, guys. I know you feel the burn. If not, I'll come deliver heavier weights. Okay. Sixty seconds. Stand up in between, drop the floor. Okay, I don't think sweating here is only for the top. Does anyone have sore abs from uh, the V ups on Wednesday? No? Yes. I don't have sore abs, so it's <laughs> fine. No one does. <laughs> Nobody does. Me included. All right. Ten seconds. We're going to our last set, single leg deadlifts into the side plank leg lift. All right. More of that. Yeah. <sighs> Here we go, guys. Twelve on each side. Take your time. Feel your hip shift back. As you ground into your front foot, you've got to push down, contracting your hamstring and glutes to stand. Switch sides when you finish. Exhale it up, inhale it back. Lift your back leg up. Even that glute hamstring are working. No discrimination here. Hopefully you guys all foam rollers at home. No massages for a while.
down to the ground. Set it up. In three, two, and one. Remember, you might just be holding a nice strong plank. When you finish, turn on the other side. Good job, guys. Push through that challenge here. Excellent job. Let's stretch it out. So, bring your left shin forward, and then if you can, we're going to cross the right leg on top. This is called double pigeon. And then you can lean forward and push your elbows into your legs for that stretch. You're trying to get your knees stacked over your ankles, so it's a little bit of a tighter step. And then you can reach forward all the way or just hit here. We're going to hold about 30 seconds. Yeah. You notice your knee is very popped up and high. Something you're going to want to work on. Lean back, uncross the legs, shake them out. Bend your right knee, cross with the left, sit up straight, oh, lean forward, ow, it's a good stretch. Breathe into it as you push your forearms down. Maybe walk the hands forward. Walk the hands back. Let's land your side. We're going to get a quad stretch. Bend your top and pull your heel into you. And then I want you to push your pelvis forward. Um, Alex is doing a different variation. Belly down. <laughs> Roll over and switch. You'll feel it a lot more if you actually contract. Whatever side you're on, take that hip forward. Good. Let's just roll onto the back now. <laughs> Lift your right leg up. Try to get it as straight as you can. You can grab behind your hamstring, and then if it, you want more, straighten your left leg. And if you want more than that, reach up towards the calf. Either a straight leg or you can bend. Take your right leg over to the left. If you were in yoga um, yesterday, this is a bit like the revolved triangle pose on your back. So feeling it in that same spot. A little bit easier to see in this pose. Let's come back all the way to the back, and take your left leg up. Find whatever version of the stretch you did on the other side. Try 
Thanks. Flex your toes. Pull it up. Pull in a little. And then take your leg up and over. Bring it back. Roll back up to seated. And bring the soles of your feet together. Butterfly pose. Bring your elbows to your inner thighs and then lean forward. Again, try and use the weight to push down. And really pull in with your arms. Sit all the way up. Come into a straddle. If you don't have room, modify. Go to the right first. Reach your arms up, turn to the right, and pull. Yeah. You're up doing gymnastics, so. It's a human. Reach up, turn and switch. Time to work on your flexibility over the next year. <laughs> We're not really sure, but the next 18 months. <laughs> Hopefully, yeah. I mean, we don't need to talk about time <laughs> timelines, but every day that we're here in this place, <laughs> come back up. Let's go center, walk yourself forward. Try and keep your toes up, knees up. <laughs> nice job, player. <laughs> Hopefully, you guys look more like me and not Julia. Now. <laughs> What's been in the I feel like you're like a toddler at the playtime. Playing with the water. <laughs> All right, reach your arms up. Take a stretch to your right. One more up, over to the left. All right, guys, awesome job today. Crushing Fridays. Really look forward to doing that again in a week. Um, I'm going to post something about classes over the weekend. So you'll get an email from me. Uh, if you could join, cool. It is going to be a free class. So if you have any friends that want to join, um, I'll give you instructions on how they can sign up for that class. Otherwise, next week is uh, same schedule, live at noon. Um, and we'll also be posting about a live boxing class that we are going to do with Chloe. So you know how to get a hold of us if you have any questions along the way. Uh, wishing you a good rest of your day. And we will be in touch about a virtual party tomorrow. So if you want to be a part of that, we know you'll be home. Um, we'd love to. Uh... There's no running from the sound. <laughs> <laughs> you can't be busy. Um, all right, you guys have a great rest of your day, and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you.